All right, well, a difficult day on central Alabama roads this morning. One person was killed in this accident on I-759 in Etowah County at the Black Creek exit. An 18-wheeler heading westbound crossed the meridian there and hit another 18-wheeler. One driver was killed. The other was taken to a hospital. That crash shut down the interstate for most of the day. Crews worked to clean up the wreckage from both of those trucks. That's right. Let's get a check on that area right now. We know CBS 42 traffic reporter Cameron Edgeworth is out there, and he joins us live from Etowah County. Cameron. Alex, well, right now, I-7059 eastbound is still shut down. Take a look. If you look at the top left of your screen, you can see crews are still working to clear that earlier accident right now. And this is causing delays on I-75 westbound right now, right near this. This is right before the Bear Creek exit. So if you're heading in this direction, you got to give yourself some extra time this morning. But in the meantime, Gadsden City Police say they are not sure when they will have the interstate reopen on I-7059 eastbound. So if that's the area you have to travel, you're going to need to take Highway 431 or Highway 238 for your detour. And if you're traveling from I-59, then you need to take exit 183. That is the Highway 431 and Highway 238 exit. For now, we are live in Gadsden, Cameron Edgeworth. CBS 42 News.